mice. What are we doing, blood? We're going in for the big cheese. But it's every mouse for himself, so don't get caught. Mouse trap! It's a zany action, a crazy contraption. The fun is catching its mouse trap. The game's mouse trap. Build a contraption to trap the other mice, but don't get caught yourself. Turn the crank, hit the boot. Suddenly, we're down the chute. Move the hand. The marble drop. The diver flip. We just can't stop. It's a zany action, a crazy contraption. The fun is catching. You wanna bite? It's mouse trap. Either at one end of the earth or the other. Time to choose. So, you better think about getting yourself an NB1 or a Nerf missile storm. Excuse me, don't you just love this? Or a Shunshu or an Arrow storm. Don't you get it? It's Nerf or nothing. Do not try to adjust your television set. It's the Nickelodeon Laser Light. An amazing new scientific breakthrough. Nickelodeon Laser Light lets you put on your own laser light show anywhere it starts. Fantastic. It's unbelievable. Plus, you control the laser's color and focus. All you need is the dark. Don't be scared of the dark. And you can create a wild laser light show. So now you can add color to any dark space. The Nickelodeon Laser Light from Just Toys. Rattle me bones! Welcome aboard, mateys. Rattle me bones, rattle me bones. Take what he will, but you rattle me bones! Spin the wheel for the treasure to take. Careful, my friend, or he'll rattle it. Shake it! Rattle me bones, turn the lights low, there's a frightening go, but don't rattle me bones! Rattle me, rattle me, rattle me bones. You can use your skill to take what you will. You can take your fill, but don't rattle me bones! Battery sold separately from ideal. Scramble is the hot new game A Playing ball won't be the same Your color comes up, you hit someone If it doesn't, you gotta run Scramble, hit someone, get a wristband If they dodge or catch the ball, give them one of yours First with six bands, win Scramble is the hot new game How many high school boys does it take to change a light bulb? Ha <laughs> ha! What a light up your life? Yeah! Give me those slim jim! Turn to the spice! <laughs> Baby, you took the dice! Need a little statement? Stab it to a slim jim! Colonel William Guy, one of the greatest martial artists in the world, travels the global tournament circuit, using it to conceal his top secret mission as leader of an elite group of international crime fighters known only by their code name, Street Fighter. The heroic man beast, Blanca, hard kicking fighting machine, Chun Li. team of the most amazing warriors ever seen have joined forces with Guile to combat the criminal empire of Shadaloo and its superhuman leader, Bison. They have their own code of honor, discipline, justice, commitment, and together they will triumph against the forces of evil. Street Fighter! Stop him! He stole my wallet! Oh, easy, kid. Did you hurt yourself? Uh-oh. Grab him! Yeah, it was a mistake! I didn't do anything! Okay, okay, but if you're lying to me, you'll wish the welcome wagon got you first. Hold it! What's the problem here? My wallet was in my back pocket. He bumped me, and now it's gone. Yeah! 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 Excuse me, sir, but I think this belongs to you. Um, guess I just 
put it in the wrong pocket. Yeah. Uh, thanks, mister. Come on, kid. You look like you could use a meal. <clears throat> my, my folks weren't all that hot for me to come out here by myself. It's kind of hard sometimes, you know? Yeah, I've been there. Yeah? Uh, look, kid, something just came up. I got a bail. Take care, huh? Uh, okay, sure. Thanks. Uh, I can't pay you back for this or anything. Yeah, yeah, you can. Call your folks. aware of the International Street Fighters Tournament taking place in Chattapur, India? Yeah, yeah, I thought about going, but my financial advisor said Cancun's a better value. You've been entered. Chun-Li and the others are already on their way. All the way to India? What's up? We believe some of the new contenders are coming out of Shadaloo. Bison will be there? We hope so. Intelligence reports are sketchy, but... Giles? Good luck. Father, please can we go home? In a moment. I wish to see the street fighters. Magnificent. I like a guy with a full head of hair. The tournament started. Let's go kick some Shadaloo butt. Make you feel better. Ah, uh, chun -Li. Ever the poet. Congratulate me, Doctor. My Street Fighter tournament has begun. Guile and his contemptuous band of roaches have arrived, and I am about to deliver them into the hands of their destroyers. Hands that I have created. Indeed, without Darcy's old notes, we'd have nothing. I don't believe in shared credit, Dr. Kirst. Too cluttered. E yes, sir, uh, of course. You are a hired wrist. Nothing more, or need I remind you? But please, Bison, don't! It'll explode! I've done everything you asked. You talk too much. <laughs> <sighs> What they're programmed to do, yes? Welcome, my trio of terror. 
What have I done? You have done my bidding, as was required of you. And now to destroy the Street Fighters! Monsters! We must destroy them before they destroy us! Destroy them? They are to be glorified! <laughs> Behold! We are witness to the end of Guile and his street fighters! <laughs> For you, bud. This ain't the arena, you know, the place where the action is. Shh! This is a temple of worship. Act civilized for once. Are you sure the other street fighters did this? It's been the custom for centuries to come here before a battle. The tournament counts. Looks like you were hit last night. I saw you last night. You were awesome. My, my Chun-Li superstar. I'll just wait till I win next time. <laughs> my, my. Tough room. Gotcha. Excellent. Begin your work, Balrog. The tape will be ready in a few more minutes. I am in the presence of a maestro. Well done, Balrog. Either my trio of terror shall rid me of the street fighters. Or the good people of Shatapur will do it for me. My pets, your turn is coming. Flash kick! I'm okay. Kicking your backside or Blanca? You know, you have fought better underwater. Yeah, I've seen mold with better moves than you up there. Oh, yeah, I'd like to hear you say that now. Well, come yeah. on. <laughs>
Oh, this is delicious! Guess you won't be needing those tapes I made for you. You want me to get rid of them? Don't be hasty. Not until I see those street fighters pummeled to dust, which should be any moment now. Yes! Yes! I can't open this thing! Oh, then let someone with talent try. Uh, no offense. Mutations. Girl, they're not human! No kidding! No. Somehow their dance seams work. They're giving off a green light. I've seen that before. Well, good for you. The rest of us are seeing stars. Sonic! work. My biggest nightmare. Ah! What have they done to my creations? All wrong! Time for the tape. Time for the tape. And the wrath of the world will crush the street fighters for me once and for all! That's right, Colonel. Always leave him wanting more. This is Escher. I need an airlift out of Chattapur. Now! What do you mean an hour to get there? The street fighters don't have an hour! If that mob hasn't ripped them apart already! Bison's behind this somehow. Now all we have to do is find him. Well, we could take out a personal. Wanted, one flaming jerk. Likes midnight strolls through minefields and moonlight invasions. Blanca saw some kind of light coming from those... those things up in the arena. Find the light, we may find Bison. No, I lost the trail back inside. One diversion coming up. Come on, love. Let's go show them what you got. Next time, could you recruit someone less perky? Good luck, Guile. We'll wait for your signal. Yeah! What signal? The Defilers! They're over there! Next time, Cammy gets to be the Defiler. It. Bison must have bolted. Look, Delsim's notes. My one chance at recovery. Go away! Get out of here! He'll destroy this place any moment now. You have to leave! Who will? Bison? Where is he? He and that Balrog fellow are gone. Balrog? Bison intends to detonate this place as soon as they're safely out of range. Ugh. Then come on. Let's get out of here. 
Impossible! I am his means of detonation. Down here, I may harm the fewest people. <sighs> I think I can override the electronic lock, but I doubt I can defuse this. Just get it off of him first. Bison's control room. I'll take it from here. Doctor, maybe you can help us after all. This is the next big thing? Yeah, so they're in a cage. <laughs> I can fight in a cage. <laughs> I'm not going to touch that line, Ken. Uh, thank you. <sighs> so much for my 15 minutes of fame. Cammy, you forget I'm the one who won? Yeah, and who's asking for your autograph, sister? <laughs> <laughs> When's our rematch, huh? Are you that anxious to lose again? Fantastic fruity, five real fruit flavors. <laughs> hey, Baldy, Baldy. Popsicle, ho ho. From good humor. How about peanut butter for lunch? How about pizza swirls? <laughs> Lunchables pizza swirls. Tasty pizza crusts you can top yourself, even with chocolate frosting. Lunchables, make fun of lunch. I'll be right down. Okay, let me do it again. So e L. Looks like a cow. Okay, just letters. E, L. Looks like a small cow. No, uh, there are no cows. Okay, let me, let me do it again. Okay. Is it a mammal? No. Not going anywhere for a while? Something with fur? No. Grab a Snickers, because nothing handles your hunger better. It's uh, one of those turny things that you keep in the drawer with a handle. Can open it? Yeah. No. Hungry? Why wait? Our tour begins Welcome. with the holding silos for the crunch berries. Wow, all berries! What's this? Don't do that. Do this! Imagine a cereal. That's all crunch berries! Blue, purple, red, nothing but the awesomely sweet taste of all crunch berries. And what do you have to say for yourself? Oops! Cabin Crunchers, oops, all berries! It's a delicious part of this balanced breakfast. Cabin! What's this? Oops! Young Bobby Engels has a problem. He needs to earn the respect of his peers. So he gets Sega Genesis, the ultimate action system. And then he buys Mortal Kombat, the arcade edition, and the all new Shinobi 3, and Marvel's X Men. Now things are pretty much okay. I said chocolate chip. 
Say it. Say it. Thank you, thank you! Supernatural things. Magic and sorcery. They're back. From out of the gloom, stalk your worst nightmares. Ghouls, zombies, werewolves, vampires. You can't be sure what lurks out there in the darkness of night. With a dark stalker. Chiron, intergalactic collector of planets, wants the Earth. And he's going to get it, even if he has to wake the undead. He summons Dimitri, Lord of the Vampires, to launch a reign of terror, to release a plague of monsters and bring humans to their knees. But other night warriors are on the prowl. Monstrous, awesome contenders with bizarre fighting powers. Immortal creatures locked in battle to decide the fate of the world. It's enough to make your blood run cold. I respect you as an artist, sweetheart. You're a great actress. Well, then why do I have to jump out of a cake? I got legit credits, you know? Hey, look, babe, you gotta do it. Otherwise, they cut off my phone. Huh. Come on, what good am I without a phone? You ain't any good with one. I am not gonna be a spark plug, and you are no longer my agent. <sighs> okay, Irv. Think of it as a challenge. I mean, things can't get any worse, can they? Oh, I feel good! Like I knew I would feel good, cause you got me here! They can and they did. I'm hot, I'm here, I'm ready! Love me! Lord Rex! Opening it for the Grateful Dead, on the toast to the town, on the idol of millions, I'm... Still unemployed. What? I said no to Lord Raptor. <laughs> I tried, babe. I really tried. <clears throat> Not hard enough. Oh, sweetie, I work hard for my 90%, but they don't want you. Your old hat. You need something new. A, a gimmick. Oh, a gimmick. A gimmick? How many other bloody zombies play rock? You'd be surprised, babe. I could see you're upset, but trust me, Bubala, you gotta get a gimmick. I am angry, Earth. I've lost that love and feeling, and now you're gone. Gone! Gone! East. It senses something in the east. <laughs> A gimmick, you say? Oh, my dear hard-working and still-living compatriot, never fear. Call back the dead, ready the contracts, for I'm on to a gimmick that'll blow them away! Forever! <laughs> Darkstalkers will return. And now, back to Darkstalkers. These energies haven't been detected on Earth for thousands of years. It can only mean one thing. Oregon, <laughs> you've usurped my authority for the last time. You're toast! You couldn't eat a six-story gargoyle if it sat in your lap. But if we're talking toast... <laughs> Perhaps you'd like some jelly. No! 
I've lost the mystic lock. I'll reacquire while you discuss attitude adjustment with the troops. Will you two please behave? Morgan, Dimitri, have a look at this. I just love strong, silent aliens. This is astounding. The trumpet of Jericho is at last within my grasp. And just what exactly is the trumpet of Jericho? Why, Dimitri, don't you vampires go to Sunday school? According to legend, this trumpet allowed the ancient Hebrews to breach the walls of Jericho. We must have that weapon. I, your general, will see to it at once. I hope this works out better than all the other times you've taken charge. <clears throat> As the artifact is in the desert, I know exactly who to send to get it. My kingdom for a camel, one hump or two. history and geography because knowledge is power and we need all the power we can get that was awesome can i learn that first you gotta learn your history and geography i gotta find out where timbuktu is try africa whoa i think timbuktu is farther south i didn't do anything it's the ring <laughs> this is way too weird harry I think that the ring wants us to go to North Africa. I thought Merlin said this ring didn't have any powers. Yeah, well, wizards seldom tell the whole story. But how are we gonna get to Africa? Mom took back her credit card. Felicia, my buff beauty, does this belong to you? Start packing. Our tickets just walked in. Nice to see you back at my gym, but I've been itching for a rematch. Okay, but this time it's gonna cost you, Lex. If I win, two round-trip tickets to Africa. It's worth it. Go! Uh, 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 you're not even straining! Oh, Lex, I'll let you use both hands for a first-class upgrade and travel money. Now, lady, you're gonna lose! Wow! First class is so cool! 500 should last us a while. It was twice your size! And buff! Will his arm be okay? <laughs> sure. I didn't break anything. We may be in Africa for a while, if we don't even know what we're looking for. If we don't know what we're looking for, then how are we gonna find it? Well, we'll just have to hope for a clue. Like that? Over there? Wow! Awesome! This has gotta mean magic! Lord Raptor! What's that zero-brained zombie doing here? That's what we're gonna find out. Come on, I've got a plan. Oh, Raptor, you daring young devil. How do you stay so bloody gorgeous?
lot on instinct. The cat thing. Yeah, but cats have nine lives! The plane's dissolving! And I think I'm gonna need them! Come on, Rick! Or we're sand pizza! Cool! The ground's coming up awful fast. No sweat. Felicia, just don't. Come on, we can't let him get... whatever it is. Mystery of life, I think I've found you! Now's our chance! My life! Raptor, you lounge act loser! Lounge act? I'll show you! Harry, quick! No one brings down the curtain on me! That ought to hold him. Raptor was headed in here. So whatever it is, is in there too. Right, let's go. No, you stay here and make sure Raptor doesn't escape. Be careful, Felicia. You don't want to have to use up one of those nine lives. Don't worry, Harry. So far, so good. Ah, I talked too soon. I gave up show business. Ah! Holy hairball! A horn that can punch holes in solid stone? The trumpet of Jericho! The Darkstalkers aren't getting this! of the great god Rudamega! You are mine! <laughs> toot toot! Darkstalkers will return. And now, back to Darkstalkers. Time for your final curtain! I have succeeded! I am master of a thousand fleas! Oh, it's... it's Louis Armstrong's horn! My ticket to the big time! Penny Garris, old thing! You look bloody marvellous! Who does your rapping? Let's just have a little looky here, shall we? Of course you know this means war. Trying to put a fight on me, eh? You 
Osiris in your shorts. Raptor, what's that undead idiot doing there? He's ruining my plan! Oh, I didn't know you had a plan. And won't Pyron be pleased to see how you've blown yet another assignment? We'll see who wins this one. Champion, my friend, and I will rock you! Now, this is a great gimmick. I can't wait to try this in New York. This is inconceivable, thwarted by my own minion! I think you're a little late for that. Lord Raptor shall feel the wrath of Dimitri, Lord of the Vampires! Come. I wouldn't miss this for the world. Any sign? Get down! It came from over there! I love rock and roll! What's this? Don't make me hurt you, Lord Raptor. <laughs> Meet me, Benoff. There to die for. You who are about to die, salute me. We can take them. You are going to get out of here. I'll try and hold them off. Oh, but things are different today. I hear every feline say they don't get tired. Uh. Hey, Raptor! Your singing sucks! What? Another critic and a half point at that! Harry, run! All eyes focus on Lord Raptor! The audience holds its breath, and they ask themselves, Is this the final fade out? Great. We end up pin cushions, and he wins an Oscar. Who give you a speaking part? You have offended Anakaris, Master of the Nile, and Lord of the Sacred Era. Save Lord Raptor! Save the star! I never thought I'd be glad to see Anna Karis. Your bones shall be ground to powder. Your body shall be crushed to dust. Your head shall be... All right, all right, I think I'll get the hint, mate. But that's not the song we're gonna sing. Seize this madness at once! Surrender the trumpet of Jericho. Pyron! Ozu, king of the zombies, demands it. We can't let Dimitri get that horn. Oh dear. Daddy takes the T-bird away, does he? <laughs> Very well. No way. Ozu can have it later. I need it now. What? You cannot defy Ozu? Well, you don't know what it's like always being the opening act. Never getting top billing. I'm sick of dressing rooms that consist of a nail in the wall. This time, I'm the star. This is my ticket to the big time, and I am not giving it up. If I can't be the world's best rock star, I'll be the world's loudest! <laughs> See, Harry, I sure could use a cat nap. You heard Felicia! Ha! So, what are you gonna do about it, you obnoxious little twit? I'm gonna stop you! 
Oh, really? And might I ask how? You've got no powers, no weapons. Well, I have. And to think, I hosted a kiddie show in the 50s. <laughs> well, I no longer work with kids or animals, sonny. <laughs> Who? Who is that supposed to make me lose my temper? Well, it did! Uh -oh. What do you know about acting, you little upstart? I've closed more shows than you've ever heard of! There's gotta be a way to beat this guy. That's it! If I can last long enough to make it... I was the original Sweeney Todd! No, no, I was the real Sweeney Todd! Look at my reviews! They were raves! I bet you wrote them yourself! Only the good ones. <laughs> you haven't lived till you've seen Lord Raptor perform! Man, does it? No one insults my work. It's time to face the music. No, no. I need somebody. from one end of these ruins to the other! And, Raptor, that's just the beginning of what I'm going to do to you. <laughs> oh, uh, look, mates, can't we uh, top this over? <laughs> Lonely rock and roll! Think we'll make it back before the car dissolves? Looks like it. Oh, and Harry, don't ever let me hear you complaining about not holding your own in a fight. I saw the amphitheater, and I knew exactly how the sound would bounce back. Only, I don't know if I learned it from the ring or from school. Wisdom is where you find it, Harry. <laughs> My little Rambo. Felicia, will you teach me how to drive? Maybe, when you're older. Darkstalkers will return. And now, back to Darkstalkers. Gonna be in trouble, your baby and the man. I wish we had sprinkles for breakfast. Hey, you wish it? I wish it. My new sprinkle spangles. A sprinkled cereal? Yeah, sprinkle spangles is the part of this complete breakfast that spangles from every angle with sprinkles. Hmm, wish we had a whole truckload of this. Hey, you wish it? I wish it. New sprinkle spangles cereal. It's every kid's wish come true. Mom! There's nothing to eat. You may 
not understand everything that comes out of his mouth. But with Sunny Delight, at least you understand what goes in it. To him, it's good. To you, it's good for him. What's not to understand? Sunny Delight, the good stuff kids go for. <laughs> get fried his fate is in your hands mighty max mighty max you can collect all his adventure sets each sold separately mighty max figure included from mattel you got a problem yeah settle it in the future with power gladiators let's do it power gladiators you control them arm them crash them in far out combat so intense you'll lose your head each time you blow your top you lose a weapon lose them all and you're scrapped Gladiators comes with two radio-controlled robots. Control the future with Power Gladiators. by a special friend as Saber Rider comes to the rescue. Stay tuned for this thrilling adventure of Saber Rider and the Star Sheriffs. out somewhere getting into trouble again. Hey, Colt! Here! Hey, fellas! Look what I got! Colt! Well, what do you guys think of my new pet? I told you I'd bring back something wild. He looks weird. <laughs> he thinks you're funny looking, too. You want to pet him, partner? No way! He's got horns. Those aren't horns. They're just love nubs. Well, I think you should let it go. What do you think, Fireball? Um, whatever. Guys, bad news. We've lost contact with an outpost. Well, what are you waiting for? 
Let's go check it out. Which outpost? New Dallas. You know how important it is. April's right. Ah! What's that? Huh? Oh, my new pet. Gross. That's enough, chum. What I do? You collect the ickiest things. Come on, let's move out now. New Dallas may be under attack. Attack? You really think so? Yes, I've been expecting trouble on that part of the range. It's top secret. You've been there, eh, Colt? Yep. Definite signs of outrider activity. Guys, did everyone know about this but me? I knew about it. Me too. And I did as well. Damn. I am think you were asleep when we discussed it. Probably dreaming of some big race. What do you know about racing, cowpuncher? Anytime you want to try out your Bronco Buster against my Red Fury Racer, just say the word. I love that city boy spirit. Yahoo! All right, all right. Do we have a job to do or what? Yes. yes. Star Sheriff's ready. My trigger finger's itching. I've got the reins. Okay, Fireball. Hit it. Yes, sir. Sure feels good to be back in the saddle again. Then kindly engage your Winchester tracking controls. You got it. Winchester tracking controls are on. Good. I think there may be an Outrider hideout somewhere nearby. All right. I'll be on the lookout for it. If I spot anything, you'll be the first to know. While you're at it, tell me if you spot that iguana. I hope it's not crawling around here. You'll have to ask Colt about that. Yes, Colt. Where is the little creature? I put him in the tanning room under the sun lamp. He loves it there. Maybe you can get him a little bathing suit with a pair of sunglasses to go with it. <laughs> Not a bad idea. He'd be the fanciest lizard on the frontier. Fun's over, boys. We're here. All right. Let's go see what we're up against. That's New Dallas. Begin landing procedure. Like we're too late. The outpost is in ruins. Hello? Is anyone here? You who? Seems like the Outriders finished the job before we got here. Yes, the settlers have been driven away and the Outriders are all gone. Well, maybe not all. There could be some still in there. Let's look. Hold on. Now, let's size up this situation before we go ambling in. Listen, real close. Huh? Yeah, they're out there, all right. Outriders. And they know we're here. Look out! I thought you had nerves of steel. Well, well, I do. There's another one. That sure was a close one. It's a good thing I've got reflexes like a rattlesnake. Cold, it was me who saved you. Whoa. Got us pinned down. Do they ever? Yeah, and we walk right into it. I say we rush them. Ah, we'd be blasted to bits. Brady's right, kid. Come on, let's circle around. I'll hang back and draw their fire. Well, keep your head down. <laughs> keep your head down. <laughs> That's funny. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Darn, my 
favorite pet. Got it. Whose bright idea was this anyway? I hope Coke got away all right. I wouldn't bet against him. Well, well, look who decided to join us. Yep, no more Uno's back. Now, let's hit him. You gotta watch your back, dude. Get out, cowboy. Look. Quite possible. The vapor beings don't give up that easily. When we blast them, it just sends them back to their own dimension. So it doesn't hurt them to keep trying. Here they come! What's the word, Top Sword? Blast off. Let's see if we can't find their base of operations. You see anything on the scanner? Yes, faint traces of alien vapor. And where there's vapor, there could be vapor beings, like outriders. That's yeah, a good possibility. But we won't really know unless we send a scout. I'll volunteer for that job. Wait, Colt. What makes you think I'm going to send you on such a dangerous assignment? Well, I thought it was obvious, partner. I'm the best. Numero uno. Yes, it's true. You are an excellent scout. But hmm. I'm going myself. Wait a minute, that's not fair! Tough luck, numero uno. Guess today you're numero dos. Don't take it personally, chum, but you are a bit brash. Who says I'm brash? Boys, why not flip a coin? All right, Top Sword, heads or tails? Neither. To be safe, let's use my coin. You don't trust me, huh? Well, that's okay. I like a man who plays it close to the vest. It'll be a rough mission, Colt. You can still back out. No dice, Saber Rider. Get set. Heads I go, tails you go. Ready? Here it comes. It's heads. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like I'm the winner. Wait, let me see that coin. Why, you think I switched them? Here. It's the same coin you gave me, partner. <laughs> of course, it's not the same one I flipped. This one's got heads on both sides. Stallion power on! Boy, he went that away. 
Well, I tried. I think I lost him. Huh? A renegade unit. Let's try Plan B. Ramrod to Bronco Buster. Colt, come in, please. He should have contacted us by now. I'm really getting worried. Me too. Something must have happened. I should have never sent him on such a dangerous mission. It was a serious mistake. As captain, I should have been the one to go. You can't take everything on yourself, Saber. Colt knew what he was in for. Navigational control. Acknowledge, April. Navigational control on. Ramrod challenge phase one. Head them up, move them out. Power stride. And ready to ride. Look out! We've been hit! Chums. Aim low, Firewall. He's got a weak foothold. Right. <laughs> 
a meltdown. Yes, that robot's working parts won't be working again for a long time. So, Cole, tell me, has your pet iguana learned any tricks yet? No, but I've learned a few things. When I was trapped back at that cave, I found out what it feels like to be a little critter caught by a big critter. Now I know it's wrong to keep any critter that doesn't want to be kept, even a leaping lizard. Surprised you guys, huh? Well, he reminds me of myself. We were both born to be wild. <laughs> Cold, you're a constant source of amazement. That right? I think she likes me. Now you go off and have a good time, and thanks for the help when I needed it. The iguana never did get the sunglasses he'd been promised, but he did us a great service. He reminded us just what a big place the new frontier is. Big enough for all creatures, great and small. Got a Michael Jordan MVP cup, a Michael's favorite burger from McDonald's. He's bound to let me play one-on-one. -on -one. Hurry into McDonald's today for Michael's favorite extra value meal, the Double Big Mac. And for 39 cents more, supersize it or any extra value meal for more fries and more drink. And get an MVP collector cup free. Charles, you sitting there. So what do you say? Just this once. What you want is what you get. To my dear friend Charles. At McDonald's today. Yeah, well I'm the doodle bear. I come with pens for writing on. Notes and names and games. Friends share and pass me on. When they ask me which tattoo I love the best. I throw over my arms. It's rosy on my chest. Cause I'm the doodle bear. The original doodle bear. I love to doodle and doodle and doodle. When there's no room for something new. Machine and come out nice and clean Cause I'm the Doodle Bear Doodle Bear comes in one of four different colors With washable doodle pans and tattoos Each bear sold separately Center with working blender and mixer requires adult assembly. Oven sold separately. Batteries and some ingredients not included. Team Claws, Muscles, and Jaws. Three dinosaurs. Super cool superheroes. Bullseye, Stags, Spike, and T-Bone. Extinction Stinks. Extreme Dinosaurs. Part man, part dinosaur. Cool. Fighting to stop the evil raptor man. I'll have you for lunch. Eat this. Team Claws, Muscles, and it's Darkwing Duck. I am a master of mystery. Your kids can help DW solve mysteries at Pizza Hut with a Darkwing Pizza Pack. They get a personal pan pizza with their favorite topping, one of two cups, and Crime Fighter Kids. Just $2.99. Yes! Taco Bell presents Nacho and Doll. Hey, Nach, how about another tasty taco? No problemo, man. <laughs> Hold it! Another bag! Oof, that was close. Now you can get one of five super cool Batman toys when you buy a Taco Bell kids meal. Like the portable bat signal, you can collect all five Batman toys only at Taco Bell. That's that food. Bong! After years of peaceful existence on the distant planet Valoria, Questar and his people were forced into battle. The power of their step crystal ripped a hole in the fabric of time, sending them backward to prehistoric Earth. Unaware that at the same moment the evil Emperor Krulos was plotting to capture the step crystal with his own grotesque Rulon forces. And so the battle continues in a new place in time with Dino Riders.
Serena. It looks like I won again. Shh, listen. Did you hear that? Hear what? I didn't hear anything. I thought I heard a Tyrannosaurus Rex. That isn't a Tyrannosaurus. But that is. Let's get out of here. Oh, great. Stranded. Now what are we gonna do? to have the help of so many dinosaur friends. Indeed, none of this would have been possible without them. Come on now, move! Let's go, you stubborn tank! Whoa! Hey, wait! No! Stop! Hold up, my friend. Next time, use your amp, Commando. Yes, sir, Questar. Of course, there uh, are still a few problems to overcome. Questar! Tark! Over here! Look what this Pachycephalosaurus can do! It's amazing! All right, now. Let's show them. That's showing them? Questar! Tark! I give you Demetrodon. Three tons of fighting force, sure to trample Rulon invaders in a single bound. But do you notice anything special about this creature? No, can't say that we do. Good. Otherwise, he'd be out of a job. Okay, Tag, show your stuff. Surprise is the key to victory. That's great, Gunner. Yeah, really great, Gunner. Now let's see what you can do with this. Suppose you tell me what it is. It's a Stegosaurus. Well, it looks like an overgrown porcupine to me. Porcupine? Yeah? Well, we found it taking on a Tyrannosaurus Rex. Why, he's a natural-born warrior. Okay, Gunner, Tag, take our newest warrior and see what you can do. you an apology, big fella. We've got to get to the ship.
destroy. Not our spirit. All right, calm down, everyone. Vector, what are we looking at? It's bad, Questar. About 70% damage to the ship and total destruction of our defense perimeters. All right, take some men and some pachycephalosauri. Start clearing the rubble out of the way. Only a few of the dinosaurs are left. The rest fled when the rumbling started. We're defenseless without the dinosaurs. Krulos will attack. They haven't all left. Great. One dinosaur against all of Krulos' armies. Gunner's right. We must get the others back. If Krulos finds them, he'll brain box every last one. Tag, you and Gunner organize some men. Move out and do it fast. We've never been so open to attack. Can I go with them? It's okay by me, Questar. We're going too! Not so fast. I need you both for something more important. I didn't want to alarm the others. The power source for the space-time energy projector has been destroyed. How badly? Completely, young star. But it gets worse. If we don't unfreeze the steps generators, we may lose it forever. We need an alternate power supply. We need lava. Lava? But that means... Penetrating roll-on controlled ground. Now I understand. Tark here will be able to guide you through the least Rulon infested region to the volcanoes. Okay, but don't make it too easy. I'd like to bash a few Rulons. You have done well, returning my bed to me. As you desired, Lord Krulos. Excellent, Croc. You will make a fine second in command. Tyrannosaurus Rex, the ultimate dinosaur warrior. No dino rider will deep brain box the giant again. We must find a way to win back Rulos's favor. Listen, what's that? I hate this planet. It's another earthquake. No, you fool. It's something else. What is it? What do you see? A golden opportunity, my bug-headed friend. Let me see. Let me see. Hey, what opportunity? I just see a bunch of dinosaurs. Of course you do, Ant Brain. If we bring them to Krulos, we shall resume our commands. Oh, yeah. There they are. We've got to catch them before they get too near the Rulon. Come on, let's go get them. hey -ya! Not yet! A dino rider! It looks like this is our lucky day! What, what happened? Caught you sleeping on the job, eh? Uh, let me go! If it's the last thing I do on Earth! All right, one more blast and we're done. Ready. Charge! That about does it, young star. I think it's about time to head back. Well, there are some advantages to having a dinosaur shortage. Oh? And what's that? 
It's a great opportunity to get closer. Just take us home, Dino Rider. You did too good of a job, Tark. Not one rule on the entire trip. But we could have used some excitement. There will be plenty of time for... <gasps> Serena, young star, what is it? Will you look at this thing? Greetings, Valerians, or should I say, Dino Riders? <laughs> Looking for trouble, Snake Eyes? I wouldn't do that if I were you, young star. You might soon regret it. I'll chance it. I have a message for Questar from Krulos. Krulos has nothing to offer us. Don't be so hasty, Dino Rider. I'm sure you'll be very interested in our uh, offer. <laughs> Bring the Dino Rider to me. Uh, let me go! Let me go! Lad, but how? I'll get you for this rat! Of course you will, young star. Now listen and listen good. If Questar ever hopes to see your Dino Rider friend again, he will deliver the space-time energy projector to Krulos at once. Handing over the step to Krulos is out of the question. We cannot risk a Rulon invasion, Questar. We must stall for time. Besides, they'd kill Lad for sure. I say we go in and get him! But how? And with what? Our dinosaur army is gone, probably brain-boxed as we speak. If we don't do as Krulos asks, he'll be at our front door in no time. Krulos is not waiting for our reply. He only hopes to catch us off guard. Questar, let me show you my plan. Rasp! Take a group of vipers. You will make the first charge of the camp to draw them out. Move out, vipers! What do we do with the young dino rider, Lord Kuros? Guard him, Antor, and make sure he doesn't escape. <laughs> Brilliant, Lord Krulos. While Questar considers your ransom, we launch a surprise attack and seize the step anyway. Because of you, boy, I will miss our great victory. Icon was right. Krulos moves fast. Go ahead and activate Project Stealth. We're counting on you. Yes, sir. Okay, let's move them out. We just got our marching papers. Stegosaurus reporting for duty, Questar. He's never seen this sort of action before, Tark. Do you uh, think he's ready? Yes, sir. Then let's go. Prepare to attack! Them. 
Let's go! Uh, they were here a second ago. They're hiding. Root them out like the cowards they are. They've taken away the step. We've spotted them. They're retreating to the south. After them! Just through the pass, boy. Tark, ready with Project Landslide. Go at your signal, Quest Star. Rulons, charge, destroy them! Okay, Stegosaurus, let's see you bring that Tyrannosaurus Rex down. Your laser guns are useless, Quest Star! This is a battle of the beast! Questar, we must remove that Rulon breastplate. Can you bring me in closer on the left? I'll try. Here goes. Fiercest of foes and one. My buddies need a place to hide out. <laughs> Come a little closer. <laughs> oh, did I scare you? Oh, I do that so well. If you take us home, we'll kiss your Aunt Martha. <laughs> we'll eat your peas. And we hope you know lots of girls. Hey, the name's Boglitz. You sold separately, and we're looking for good homes. Maybe yours. <laughs> I don't know how you do it. I put together some really impressive deals. But this thing you've pulled off, it's amazing. A big and tasty for just a dollar? How do you do it? What's your secret? Mm -hmm. Got a buck? You're in luck. Because you can get a delicious, beefy, big and tasty, a McChicken sandwich, and lots of your other favorites on McDonald's dollar menu every day. Together, Grimace, we could own this town. Good, don't bend too hard on the legs. Yeah, that, that's close enough. Okay, who knows what a two-point landing is? Oop, sorry. Okay, is this bad? I got a tangle. All right. You go! What a 
could you? I got an idea. Why jump? Yes, you can do this. Now jump. He's training for his biggest adventure yet. Oh yeah, he's ready. Come on, yeah. trust me. Yeah. Jump. I say you got that insurance form. Thanks, Rod. Yeah. yeah thanks, Rod. PlayStation. Uh, yeah. We're getting calls about a wild party over here. Know anything about it? I didn't think so. Which one of you jokers goes by the name Mario? It's -a me. Could you step outside, please? Welcome to Mario Party, where you and three friends battle it out all night long. With six adventure boards and 50 mini games, this party's just getting going. Mario Party, only on Nintendo 64. But it's -a me, Mario. Yeah, tell it to the judge. Get in or get out. Photograph the elusive Pokemon. How do you do it? You're gonna be fast. Ah, missed him. And you better be good. Ah. Great pictures. That's the name of the game in Pokemon Snap. You can go to a participating Blockbuster store, print out your best shots, grab an entry form, and mail it to Nintendo's Take Your Best Shot contest. The best shot wins an Australian Safari for four. And there's lots of other great prizes. Three dollars per sticker page. Many will enter. Few will win. Hang on, it's gotta be fun. Pokemon Snap. Take your best shot. Dunkaroos is the cookie you drunk for as much frosting as you want. So how do you do your Dunkaroos? It's super duper deep dunk. Mm -hmm. Long distance dainty dunk. You can dunk a Dunkaroo in as much chocolate or vanilla frosting as you want. Mm. So how do you do your Dunkaroos? We have this job to do down south. I knew this old Jeep sandblaster could handle it, but I didn't know if I could. The trail was rough, what there was of it, but we made it. Okay, Ben, you're home. You gotta do what you gotta do. Power Wheels new Jeep sandblaster. Adult supervision required. The evil alien, M. Grocer. Only Colonel Chance can save the Earth from enslavement. Only Laser Wars has advanced laser technology that shakes warriors till they fall. Explodes robots. Robot destroyed. Blows up vehicles. Awesome. Reassembly complete. You fire, you hit, hit, hit. They scream, they fall. Yeah. You fire, Gotcha. You, hit, you laser destroy war. them all. Fight the laser war. Laser Wars with advanced laser technology to stun or destroy. Warriors, robots, and vehicles sold separately. are the tales of the Skeleton Warriors. Skeleton Warriors! Skeleton Warriors! Skeleton Warriors! intelligence and determination. No battle is ever won without them. But when those attributes are misplaced, are they as easily recovered as other weapons of war?
me there's a chance this could fail? Baron, this is all experimental. So many variables, so little control. All I care about is success. Now tell me, are we ready? We're ready. Now, for the Legion of Light! <laughs> and exactly how soon before all four reflectors are operational? Soon. Now, in fact. his own warriors to keep us from his crystal. And our people? The scanner picks up everybody. Except one. I'm going back up. No, we can't go back for the crystal. This whole mountain is rigged to blow. Report back to the base camp. Have Guardian organize a search party for our missing member as soon as it's dark. No. I'll start looking now. I said we'll send out a search team after it's dark. And I said I'll go now. It's Talon. She's the one missing. Move that reflector and take out this mountain! <sighs> no damage. The structural integrity of your half of the crystal is intact. And when the reflectors are online? Well, in theory, the amplified energies will enhance its power. Destruct sequence initiated in 20 seconds. Will there be enough power to make up for the half still in the hands of the Legion of Light? According to all calculations. 15 seconds until auto destruct. Excellent, Doctor. I want that power. Uh, of course, my lead. Now, please, I really must insist Seven, that we evacuate. Six, yes, five, well, four, whatever. Three, two, one. Initiate auto destruct. Girl, 
We better check in or Light Star and Grimskull will think we're in trouble or something. You must go now. I'll be all right alone. You must go and find my brothers, now. Fly safe. Campbell, you and Thomas organized two squadrons to comb the eastern quadrant. We have to catch Baron Dark before he can set up his operation again. Dark could be anywhere out there, even with all available personnel out looking for him. What about Talon? I said all available. You're going to be too busy out there looking for our sister. Thank you, Justin. I know you'd rather go yourself. All right, people. Let's move out. Keep looking, you fools. Princess Tailspin's got to be here somewhere. The Baron will appreciate a little initiative for once. Yes, well, I'm still picking dirt out of me joints, aren't I? I don't like having mountains blown out from under me. Well, would you rather have one dropped on top of you? I'm sure the Baron will be happy to oblige. Yeah, well, you ask me, these pulse indicators won't pick up anything. I saw her fall and it wasn't pretty. Then look for something really ugly. Come on. Now, isn't that the royal birdie? Ooh. <laughs> oh, the spider is about to catch the helpless fly. She can't be far. I may not be able to see any skeleton warriors coming, but maybe I can hear them. No sign of a reminder. They're right in front of me. She can't have vanished into thin air. Ah, patience, please, Baron. This technology is still highly experimental. Experimental? Look at our cyborg. It's all experimental. With enough power, anything is possible. Where am I? Cool air. Rock floor. Must be a cave of some sort. I hope nobody's home. Water. Find the water. Thirsty. Get a drink. Set up defenses. Alarm. Nothing in here. Here now, we stop it. Stay. Naga, slow down. Oh, we've got work to do. <laughs> Any word yet on Talon? No. Grim's gonna call in when he finds something. Best to concentrate on what the Baron's up to. And from what I've been able to determine, it's serious. Hmm. I'm afraid he's trying to. Well, for lack of a better term, supercharge his half of the crystal. But that's insane. Too much energy in his half of the crystal could fracture. Or even explode. No, nah, but according to my model, with just enough, his half could be as powerful as the whole crystal. And we could be in a whole lot of trouble. Guardian, you're breaking up. Repeat, 
Yep. Lightstar, I, I can't hear you. The crystal. Dark, you fool. You dangerous, dangerous fool. Where are you? Brought me any royal remnants? Well, Baron, sir, uh, uh, it's like this, actually. Uh, these woods are full of uh, trees. And what would this place be? And uh, so small in pieces in which would be a ah, if... What's happening with this transmitter? Sire, it's the crystal. The more energy we channel into it, the greater the interference it generates. Gad, that static was annoying. Now, on to more important work. So, Cyborn, how much longer? Soon, Baron. The reflector will be online shortly. <sighs> the promise of ultimate power does take the sting out of life's little annoyances, eh, Cyborn? Oh, great. I can't see him coming, and now I can't hear him coming either. Any more surprise visitors? I better have a few surprises myself. Guardian, Guardian, can't hear a thing out there. Seraphine, Guardian, where's Tal? Is is she here? No. Seraphina arrived a short while ago, alone. What about Grimskull? No word. And we're not likely to get any either. This mad crystal scheme of Baron Darks has shut down all transmissions. You mean Grimskull and Talon are both cut off out there? Glad you're enjoying yourself. I'm sure the Baron will enjoy sharing the humor of the situation if these fireworks don't succeed in flushing out Her Royal Highness. <laughs> Typical. Well, well, well. Looks like somebody's worried about Sif. Base. Base, can you hear me? Base Guardian, do you read? Probably not, but I do. For the Legion of Lightbulbs! <laughs> going down and going up. Your way. Don't forget to write. Miss me, Principal. Miss me, miss me. Now you gotta kiss me. I don't. I don't think so. All right, sis. You have to be around here somewhere. We've lost all contact with the search team. Yeah, enough of this incompetence. Get that reflector online now. I'll go finish this job myself. And remember, our comm links won't be working. You'll be on your own up there. So use your best judgment. Understood? Lightstone, I must speak with you. It's urgent. Lightstar, there's only one way to stop Baron Dark now. I know. We're leaving right now to take out the remaining reflector. No, that's not enough. Dark will simply put up more reflectors and wait until the next sunny day. So, what are you saying? The only way to stop Baron Dark from achieving his goal is to overload the crystal with energy, fundamentally changing its very structure. So then Baron Dark won't be able to power it enough to serve his purposes. Exactly. But this comes at a price. Well, there's... No guarantee that his half will reunite properly with ours, assuming we ever get it back. And there's a more immediate concern. If you're able to energize the reflector properly, the crystal will overload, its structure will change, and the resulting explosion will destroy this whole area. We can evacuate the safe camp in time, but... Damn it. And Grimskull, they're still out there. Of 
my calculations are accurate, we have less than one hour before the crystal achieves maximum power enhancement. After that, nothing will be able to stop Baron Dark. Begin evacuating the safe camp, Guardian. When everyone's clear, I'll handle the reflector. As you wish, Lightstar. Talon, Grimskull, hurry! Hello there, sis. I'm lucky you missed. You usually don't. I'm having a little trouble seeing. Tell him. No, no, I'll be all right. I'm getting better. Slowly. Then let's get you out of here. Carefully. We'll have the camp struck and the area cleared in five more minutes. That leaves ten minutes to overload the crystal. Anything from Talon or Grimskull? Nothing. They'll be out there when I do this. Then they'll understand. I'm not sure that I do. <coughs> Seraphina, forgive me, but I don't know where Talon is and I can't reach her. But you can! Seraphina! We send Seraphina with a recording chip and, and maybe she can get word to them to get out of there in time. Justin, it's a long shot. My favorite kind of odds. For the Legion of Light. For my family. Intruder alert. Intruder alert. Secure sound plan. Respond. She's a regular homing pigeon. Serafina's done well. Let's go. Leaving so soon, I won't hear of it. Then open them slowly. Talon. Talon, can you see us? Yes! And nothing has ever looked so good in my life! As you gaze out upon those who would oppose you, do you also look beyond yourself for the tools required for victory? At what point do you turn your gaze inward? 
And what do you find there? cookies with candy coated chocolate pieces rainbow colored by us elves amazing harnessing the rainbow to satisfy humanity's craving for cookies and candy rainbow chips deluxe from keebler if a pizza with three toppings cost 10.99 what would i pay for six toppings well 10.99 the reason is it's the Bigfoot Big Six Pizza. Get our special six toppings for the three topping price of $10.99. Are you sure you're the pizza guy? Bigfoot from Pizza Hut. A legendary value. Marvel Comics X-Men video packs are at Pizza Hut just for the holidays. So hurry and get your claws on them. Danita Stokes, president of HAG. It's bad enough that Sega Genesis has the most 16-bit games, but this new Sonic the Hedgehog, oh, he really dusts my doilies. They say he's incredibly fast. Well, what's the hurry, mister? Hmm? And about his attitude. Smarty pants! Why can't it be more like that nice boy, Mario? Oh! oh. <laughs> Little brat! Sonic the Hedgehog. Now included when you buy a Genesis system. Fred Armstrong, I will destroy you! Introducing Batman! Stretch Armstrong's arch enemy! Use the super sucking back bump to turn him into a mutating monster! Then stretch him to villainous proportions! He stays that way until you press his cybernetic button! But will this be the end of Stretch Armstrong? Stay tuned! Oh. Batman Stretch Armstrong's arch enemy from Cap Toys, who else? Hey, I already... 
we have. Uh, uh, hey! He loses his man and breaks for the end zone, having faked Nagurski right out of his pants! He turns, he leaps, he's going, going, going! Touchdown! The crowd goes wild! The million dollar endorsements flood in! I got a feeling I'm not in gym class anymore. Angus, what do you make of it? Aye, makes me forget all oh, what's his name on the Niner. What happened? How'd I get here? A portal in the end zone. <laughs> but where am I? Deep in the heart of the Scottish Highlands. Virgil, hey, Normie, what's up, guys? What's going on? What am I doing here? Fulfilling destiny, mighty one. I diagram that play to bring you here. Presently, I fear no less than the world itself is hanging in the cosmic balance. Yeah, so what else is new? Hurry, Mighty Max, we must get to the portal. Only you can save humanity from the dread horrors threatening it. Kind of getting to be a habit of mine. <laughs> I thought I wasn't supposed to start scuba lessons till summer. <clears throat> it would appear something has gone amiss. <laughs> yeah, us! Mm. <laughs> Everything checks on the map, but there, there should have been an oil tanker here. Well, so what are we supposed to do, Verge? Wait for the next bus to Schenectady? Whoa, whoa. Holy Captain Nemo! Well, howdy, y'all. You look a little on the moist side. Need a lift? Like the thing the old sonar picked you up. You'll be having a mad at long swim home. Well, thanks, mister, but who are you and what are you doing out here in a sub? J. Ollie into Pettibone's name. Ollie to my pals. All's my business. Ollie Oil. Might say it's my life. In fact, I do say it's my life. Anywho, whole slew of my oil tankers done gone missing around here. Well, I said to myself, self, if you're rich enough to lose tankers, you ought to be rich enough to find them too, don't you think? Never mind, it's a rhetorical question. I figure they went down. Or up. And if this here experimental submersible can't find them, well, I'll just have to build me a spaceship. But I will find them. And when I do... What's that? What's going on? Hornet Sands just picked up something. Great Gorgonzola! Ooh, big old nasty shark headed right this way. And he's ugly. Whoa! Just smother me! Do something! Do something? Ain't nothing I can't do! I'm J. Oleander Pettibone! I'm rich, boy! Huh? Yeah! That there's 10,000 volts of the finest electricity money can buy! Look at him! Running scared! <laughs> That's the power of money right there, boy! It ain't nothing he can't buy! You can quote me! Take care, mighty one. I have doubts about our host's mental stability. Not me. I know he's crazy. What's that you say, boy? Uh, nothing, Jay. Uh, just talking to my chicken here. Well, that's real cute! Sad, but cute. Poor kid must be a little touched. Whoa! Look at that one! Reminds me of my Uncle Billy! A and look at those! Like mini light bulbs. Yeah, must be handy for blackouts, huh? Ah, the mysterious beauty of life under the sea. Truly magnificent, is it not? Rocks and fish and water. There's more to it than that. There's plants and microorganisms, whole ships lying ravaged at the bottom of the sea. It's a veritable graveyard. Look at them all. Oh, that one there, that's mine. And that one. My beautiful ships. Look at what they done to them. Well, whoever did this, watch out. I got boots made for stomping. I can help. I have big feet. Well, hold it. Wait a second. Slow down. We don't even know who we're dealing with here. Not who. What? Whoever, whatever. It don't make no never mind. I got money to buy any water fine. You said it! Giant squid! Now we know what happened to those ships. And, and it's going to happen to us. Lever, pull the lever, boy! Too little, I'm afraid. Squids of this type are known to have complex nervous systems allowing for rapid recovery. What the... Cocking chicken? Pleased to make your acquaintance. My name is Virgil. And I'm a fowl, not a chicken. Ah! 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 
charge of squid evading. Somewhere that squid's got us trapped in here, man. Oh, put it in park, son. Huh? We got enough fritters and champagne to last for months. Whoa! I mean, we're sauteed oysters. We're not moving. Won't that squid ever learn? Not squid. Land. Well, hot diggity. This place is something else. That's quite a resort they got hidden down here. It's a city, and quite an ancient one, I should say. Yeah, and from the looks of it, everyone took a long weekend. Careful, Mighty Max. There could be danger among those ruins. Come on, danger's Normie's middle name. Isn't that right, big guy? Lead the way. <sighs> this year will make one pugnacious tourist attraction. Boys, we're millionaires, and I'm gonna share it with all of you. <laughs> Itty funny, of course. Don't you think you'd better ask the local inhabitants first? Local smokers. <laughs> Ain't no one lived here for centuries. Even if they did, I'd buy them off. Woo! Ambush! Look out! Squid in the hole! Oh, look! It's just one little squiddy, dude. Whoa, whoa, and several hundred of his pods! They look friendly, don't they? I mean, they don't look unfriendly for, you know, squids, that is, sort of. Not just any squids. I imagine they're an ancient offshoot of the more familiar cephalopod mollusks, the genus Loligo Orosha. But who cares what they is? It's what they've done to my oil tankers that's important. What? How do you figure? Where's the proof? Proof? What about a giant squid and them squid-headed things? <laughs> that's all the proof I need. Let's get it. Come on, go ahead. Get after there, boy. Tear them apart before they get us. You can do it. Now, right ahead. Go on. No! They're not I mean, they have lots of arms, okay, but no weapons. Anyway, they seem peaceful enough. Uh, how about it, squid dudes? Live long and... Shooting. <laughs> so much for diplomacy. That's showing them some guts, boy. They're running scared like rabbits. We gotta follow them. They may know a way out. Point me! Well, I gotta admit, this ain't bad for rapid transit. Yeah. No traffic either. Must have missed rush hour. Yeah, well, let's just hope that yammer and chicken of yours can see as far as it can spit. There they are. A mighty one, right turn up ahead. And don't forget to signal. Hey, check it out, guys. It's the happening part of town. I guess they don't get many visitors here, huh? Those uh, street lamps are indeed. They appear to be luminescent fish used in the absence of electricity. Now, if I'm not mistaken, we're dealing with a very ancient civilization. Cool. What does it all mean? Don't mean deadly, son. Ooh, but maybe that dude. Whoa, I haven't seen
haven't seen this much gold since my cousin got her cavities filled. Where no squid thing is go, son. I smell them dead ahead. There they are. Unless I'm sorely mistaken, that is the leader. But he seems to be very frightened. Frightened? <clears throat> One side feather, let me deal with this. I, sir, have grievances, outrages, and assorted atrocities to be named later. I demand satisfaction. Heads will roll. Ha! Cowards! I knew it! You're scared him to death, man! Well, I hope so. Serves him right. Ollie, what do you say we try a different approach? Okay, uh, me, Mighty Max, you, uh, Squid Dude. Um, my name's Calamaras. I am the leader of my people. Yes, I mean, yes, that is what I am, leader. Y you? English? B but how? Trash, you throw it away, we pick it up, tastes good too. You're not going to hurt us, are you? We're, no! No, we're friends! And in, in fact, why don't we do lunch sometimes? Yeah, I'll show you around my, my crib. It's lots of fun. Babes, you wouldn't believe. Oh man, you'll love it! Oh, that would be lovely. We don't get out much, not since the squid trapped us here. Yeah, yeah, and I gotta tell you, I was meaning to ask you about that. When exactly did that happen? Oh, coming up on a millennium in June. Seems like only yesterday. What? Seems like only yesterday. No, 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 you've been trapped here all that time? Haven't you ever tried to... Escape never, not once, not our snow backbone. We're invertebrates, you understand. But hey, it's not about backbone, it's about the need to try, of pulling together. Okay, listen up, everyone. I see we can take that squid. Sure, it'll be tough, and we might lose a man or squid along the way, but just remember one thing. Your bravery today means freedom tomorrow. So let's do it! Yes! Get out there and beat that squid! What do you say? It'll eat us. No, oh, listen, man, I'm not just thinking about you. I want to get out of here, too. What can I do? I'm terribly sorry. We're very timid squids. Instinct, you know, like the big squid goes for the light. We go for cowardice. <laughs> How do you like that? The going gets rough and the squid turns chicken. I beg your pardon. Calamaris, you said the giant squid is attracted by light? That is correct. Well, then that means where there's no light, there's no squid. Get boots, we can bamboose. Yahoo! No, 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 wait, Ollie, come back! I didn't mean that! Strange man, strange words. What's he mean, Vamoose? I'm afraid it means trouble. Too late! They're often sailing! Wait! Wait for us! Ah, all is not lost yet! Look, it's the mighty one! You can't leave! You won't even be able to see where you're going without the lights on! Heave ho, boy! We're busted out! This is my chance to run for the roses! Yeah! The opening must be out here somewhere. Now, if I can just see my way clear... The small size of it was the only thing keeping the giant squid out. Norman, I say, let's be off before. No, I move for no squid. It's no use, Norman. Norman. Wait, the light! It's drawn toward the light! Raise the light, lead the squid back out to sea! Yes, that's it! It's following us! Onward! Come on, baby, don't fail me now! Not with the squid going to town! Dog! Norman, overlap towards the opening. No, oh, hurry, Norman!
Enough juice for one more jolt. Good. That's all we need. What, 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 what are you aiming to do, son? We're going to blow that overgrown mollusk to bits. You got a problem with that? <gasps> I got two words for that plan, boy. In and sane. Hey, man, don't worry. We'll be long gone in the escape pod. I mean, what could possibly go wrong? Hey! <laughs> like sardines. I hate sardines. So much for my customary heroics to say nothing of a promising football career. Hey, way to go, squid dudes. Crunch time, and the squids come through with the clutch assist. Man, who would have thought it? Now, we just get into position to blow that tanker, and... Ollie? Ollie? Oh, no! done well, Calamaris. My city, my people, we had to try just once. I fear Mighty Max is on his own now. Going somewhere? Well now, Mr. Macho Oil Tycoon. No, 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 you got me wrong. I'm just... I'm a coward. I admit it. I'm yellow as a rose of cases. I ain't got no gallant or son. All I got's money. I guess it don't buy everything. Newsflash, Ollie. If the squid dudes can do it, so can you. Now get out there and be brave! Great speech. I guess you're right. But are you sure you won't be brave for me? I mean, uh, there's a hundred dollar bill in that for you, know what I mean? We're almost there, Ollie. Yeah. Hit the switch, Ollie! Hark! The end of the giant squid! But what a mighty Max and Ollie! Move feathers now! Woo! Scratch one squid! <laughs> Now you are free to leave this city if you want, and all thanks to your bravery. <laughs> and yours. Oh, shucks. <laughs> it's worth nothing. <sighs> Fresh air at last. It's like... Fresh money! <laughs> Almost. I'm sure my people will pick us up in no time. Now, don't you worry none about the movie rights, partners. I got me a sweetheart deal. We'll split 7 to 30. <laughs> Folks not gonna believe this adventure, but with you to back me up, we'll clean up at the box office. I can see it now. Names and lights, lines around the block. I'll make another fortune. <laughs> Adios, amigo. What do you mean by that? Hey, hey, wh where y'all going? I need you to collaborate my story. Well, that's showbiz, Ollie. Well, you'll be sorry. You could have been rich like me. Go. All right, then, look. How about 60 40? 50 50? <laughs> this week, we went into the depths of the ocean to battle a giant squid. Squids are invertebrates, which means they don't have a backbone. And giant squids are the largest invertebrates on Earth. They eat meat and have extremely advanced eyes that can spot their prey hundreds of yards away. Kind of takes the fun out of swimming, huh? See you next week. Once upon a time, there was a young dragon named Spyro. He journeyed across enchanting worlds to rescue other dragons from the spells of Nasty Mork. After battling Nasty and his minions, Spyro brought peace back to the land. Spyromania swept the country, and everyone lived happily ever after. Not! That feisty lizard burned herds of a sheep! Cool! 
PlayStation. Over here, I'm a boglin. Me and my buddies need a place to hide out. <laughs> Come a little closer. Oh, did I scare you? Oh, I do that so well. If you take us home, we'll kiss your Aunt Martha. <laughs> we'll eat your peas. And we hope you know lots of girls. Hey, the name's Boglin. You sold separately, and we're looking for good homes. Maybe yours. <laughs> And action. Romeo, Romeo, wherefore art thou, Romeo? Again, please. Again? Again. <laughs> Art thou bored? Yeah. Step into a Slim Jim. <laughs> Turn to the spice. <laughs> that baby juicy taste. <laughs> Need a little excitement. Step into a Slim Jim. Hello, Mrs. Smith. Randy, you're getting so tall. Yes, I'm getting tall. Want to see my gackoid, Mrs. Smith? Oh, it's cute. Gackoids. Wear room. Gackoids. Each comes with its own gack. Create your own monsters and make them come alive. And new gack colors never seen before. Gackoids. Each Nickelodeon gackoids figure comes with two ounces of gack. New four-ounce colors coming soon. Each sold separately from Mattel. show what an atmosphere what fun and for free oh, i don't know about this place chick <laughs> it seems wholesome and who'd want to treat us to it obviously it's some citizen we've helped expressing his gratitude come on arthur live a little the night is young and we have umbrellas in our drinks what could go wrong in a swell place like the evil eye <laughs> there, here. I told you those invitations would work. Soon the tick will be a slave to my will. You didn't tell me he was so big. Ah, but his brain is the size of a cherry pit. And it's mine for the taking. Good heavens! It works! Oh, <laughs> thank you. Thank you very much. And now, the evil eye is proud to present the world's greatest mentalist, the amazing Mr. Mental. Thank you, Lotta Bellor. Yay! I love a good mentalist. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome. Without further ado, it's on with the show. I shall begin by donning this blindfold while my beautiful assistant, Minder, enters the audience. Now, I will demonstrate my amazing mind by identifying objects selected at random by the beautiful Minder. I'm seeing... Oh, is it... is it... could it be a piece of rope? Yes, Mr. Mental. <laughs> the 
lap of the other. Incredible. And now, my another object, if you please. Uh, I, I'm seeing a group of objects. This is a hard one. Are they a timing clock, fuse wire, and a package of high explosives? <laughs> For my next phenomenal feat, I will require a volunteer from the audience. You, sir! <laughs> Me? Give him a hand, everybody! <laughs> my, my. <laughs> Aren't you a big fella? And now, a demonstration of the marvelous and always amusing powers of hypnosis! <laughs> Tick! Your mind is under my control. Your will is now mine. <laughs> okay, my will is yours. There you have it! An amazing feat of mind control! Hmm, demanding crowd. Very well. Cluck like a chicken! Cluck, cluck. Cluck, cluck. I release you! For now. Thank you! Thank you! <laughs> Hasn't he been a great sport, folks? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Tick, are you all right? Uh, yeah, I guess so. Well, I think we've sampled enough atmosphere for one night. Uh, let's go home. There it is. The Pendecker Laboratory. That gizmo you want? It's in there? It is no mere gizmo, my dear, but an experimental device that will make my mind the most powerful force on Earth! Nothing will stop me! Yeah, right. You don't even swim, and those walls can withstand a dynamite blast. Why do you think I forged my mind link with the tick? To make sure that the tick would do the swimming tonight, and worse... <laughs> Hello. Do me a favor. Go to the Pendecker Laboratory and bring me the box labeled Thinking Caps. Go and take it. Destroy anything that stands in your way. for two lights. You'll see a filling station on your right. Don't take that right! Keep going for another block. Mind! Uh, would you turn that thing down? I'm controlling a mind here. Control yourself. I'm trying to watch this. I am this close to ruling the world! You know what I miss? I miss the old days, when I'd think up a sinister scheme for world domination and you'd show a little emotional support. Tick! Oh. Oh. Arthur. Hi. I just had the craziest dream. Uh, Mr. Mental, you know, the guy from the nightclub? He was giving me directions, and I was powerless to resist. Directions? All right, all right, all right. I'll turn it off, okay? What kind of directions? I'm not sure. Something about going for a swim. I'm still in control here. Try to fight it, Tick. I'll get help. 
So what are we gonna do? Hey, you guys wanna see my fabulous new place? In the sewer? <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> of course, I found a very beautiful couch. <laughs> the Flatter Mouse, sewer urchin, crusading chameleon. I need your help. The tick is in trouble. Rise awaits on that island. Let nothing stop you. Life. Your will is mine. All right, now, who had the Danish? All I know is he said something about going for a swim. Water. People swim in water. Ah, oh, neat. I did some of my very best work in water. Yeah. How bet he's going to the river? All right, let's go to the waterfront. No, nothing. Maybe he went home and went to bed. See anything down there? I didn't find a tick, but I found a beautiful pie. Oh, man. What? Ah! Hey, it's the tick. Ah, oh, tick. Yeah, definitely glad it's you. We thought you were something very dangerous. Stop him! Bricks! I told you, the tick's mind is being controlled by an evil force. Oh, yes, I see. Well, uh, tell me how it all turns out. You have the thinking cap. Excellent. Bring it to me! Tick, you've got to fight it. Don't give in. Tick? Tick, let nothing stand in your way. Tick, what's wrong? Where, where are you going? Tick, don't do this. It's Arthur, your sidekick. Sidekick. Arthur? What's going on? What am I doing? Good question! Destroy him! Him and all that stands in your way! Bring me the thinking cap! I... don't... wanna... Come on! Crusading Chameleon, help me get Sewer Urchin down. We've got to save the Tick! Tick, you must heed my commands! Oh, nuts, mind, I'm losing him. I, I must pummel his mind, beat his will into submission! Whatever. I must regain total control! I know. I'll open the floodgates of his own worst nightmare! This will take every ounce of my mental strength. I must enter the Tick's mind! I wonder what the Tick's worst nightmare will be. Larry. 
reached the offices of the Tick's worst nightmare. The Tick is out of his mind right now. If you'd like to leave a message, please wait for the tone. If you'd like to speak to an operator, press star. <laughs> Day zero. job? Other options, In an pound. office? Pound. My pound. worst nightmare! Pound. Pound. No! The Tick, here's the shank of the note. Let me just write the Anderson gave himself the promotion. Tick, you're not so special. Anyone can touch that. You're not so special. Anyone can touch that. The Tick, here's the shank of the now, no more fooling around. No more fooling around. He's moving again. Let's go! Straight ahead. Two more blocks. You can't miss it. Ooh, man. I gotta get some sleep. We got a matinee tomorrow. No, tomorrow we rule the world. Yeah, right. Night, Mal. It will give an ordinary human mental abilities to rival mine. So it will give me the powers of the gods. That feels good. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. <laughs> Going to do to you? Hi, guys. A tick! Mr. Mental took over your mind, and now he's gonna take over the world with that thinking cap. That rat! Let's get him, boys! Wait! He's too powerful with that thinking cap, but it runs on an internal combustion engine. So? What's your point? Yeah. We've got to get close enough to that helmet to pull the choke on its engine and flood his mind! Mental. Don't mess with me, you fool! I'm cooking with gas! Batter up, boys! Get off me! Headache I've got! I'd almost say you deserve it. The human mind is a dangerous plaything, boys. When it's used for evil, watch out! But when it's used for good, then things are much nicer. And let's try and keep that in mind.